Hi guys. Um, I'll talk about the new apps that found in the. I think it's found in the Samsung apps. Uh, after you update your Samsung Galaxy S into the uh, Android 2.2 for you. So, uh, which is the uh, Snap and Go apps? Uh, this one, Snap and Go. So, uh, what it does is that it's actually transfer uh, your file in between your computer to your phone via the wireless network in a very interesting way. So, um, let's just open the apps over here. And we start searching for for holes uh, within the the wireless network that's connected that this phone connected to. Let's cancel that because I already have my phone over here, uh, my my computer over here. So, and also, uh, uh, your computer actually actually have to have the same step and go applications. So, uh, how you get that apps is by uh, you can create one through here. Okay. Uh, create PC in installation. After it's created, then you have to send to your uh, uh, PC via the uh, either Wi-Fi or USB connection. After it's installed, then you only you can use the Step and Go uh, apps. So uh, let's connect to my PC now. Waiting for approval. There will be something pop up here that asks for my approval for my phone to connect. Uh, it's already came up. Oh, it's actually behind the thing. Okay. So I will just approve it and we come back to my phone over here. It's connected now. So uh, let's just try to maybe get a file for my uh, computer. So how we're going to do that is that we just aim this camera over here. Okay, to the file that I wanted to, let's say this picture over here. So I just aim it and then I just click the snap button, take the picture of it. And there you go, just snap it. And we'll start the transfer via the Wi-Fi. It's already done. So, okay. Then we uh, let's look for the file. See where it's found. Just uh, uh, click the back button. Yep, I want to exit it. And you can find the file in your uh, gallery over here. It will actually create a new folder because it's not in the uh, uh, usual uh, 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 picture folder of your Android device, so it will be in a step and go uh, folder. So this is the one that I get just now, the finger. And uh, of course, if it's a uh, 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 audio file, uh, you actually have to uh, transfer it to the media folder, which is. You, know, you can do it over here. Uh, it will, everything that you download we are using the step and go will be found inside this folder. So all we have to do is that you just uh, transfer it to the place that you want it to be or by copy or, or, or cut it to the place. So okay, uh, let's be done with that. And we go back to the uh, step and go. Searching for us again. Let's just cancel that and just connect to my computer here. Waiting for the approval sign, it's come out. Yes, approve. So this time around, we're going to send a file back to my PC. So just I just click the post button over here. It will ask me whatever the file I want to send, a picture, video, or audio. So let's say I try a bigger file, just see how fast this thing can go. So audio. I'm oh, sorry, I mean audio, not video. So uh, click the music player. So I was say, Get a file, maybe. Uh, oops, sorry. Maybe just this one. Maybe you belong to me. This is around few megabytes. A usual MP3, think around six megabyte or so. So we we'll just get it back to my screen over here, and step to the event, whichever folder that I wanted to send it to. Doesn't matter if in between uh, or in the back or in the front. So I just step on it anywhere of the folder. Just click. There you go, it's standing right now. So as you can see, it's quite fast. I think this MP3 is around five to six megabyte maybe. So yep, there you go, it's done. Save to the target folder. Let's click OK, and we'll go come back to here to check if it's really have came to the folder that I wanted to be. Yep, it's over here. You can see that. Oh, it's on, it's actually around seven megabyte, and that's really fast. So uh, okay, that's all. Hope this helps.